So a quick update on the DIY electric piano project. I've been making some magnets, so I've just grabbed these in some grips, check that I'm using the right pole, because all the magnets need to be orientated with the poles the same direction. And I'm just going to grind a little taper on the end of each one. This has been covered in the previous episode to see why we need this. And it's not ideal, I'd like a little a more jig friendly setup, but just for now to build this little piano. Yeah, it seems to work okay. So next we now start to input each of the magnets into the pickups. So as these are being 3D printed, there might be slight tolerances and I did undersize it a little bit. So I'm going to drill a hole to make sure that it fits. And then we're just going to tap the magnet in very gently. Now magnets don't like heat or impact and I know I'm doing both of those. So it's just not ideal. And then we just want to make sure as we tap it in, it's aligned correctly. So that all the alignments and angles are aligned across the whole harp. This one's been a bit stubborn, so we'll align it again. Well, so I've set up the electronics. So I've soldered these into groups of three, similar to how they would be on a fender rods, but this is a shorter length. And then I've also included a jack, just so I can plug an instrument cable straight in. I've included a couple of wire clips just to neaten it up. And then this can slot onto the other side of the other side of the harp we previously created. So once this is held together, we'll be able to trim the tines to length and begin to tune it and voice it. But then one other thing I've been doing in the background is also creating keycaps. These are just 3D printed, so about a 0.8 of a millimetre thick, and it's just white PLA. I'm going to glue these on top of the keys. And then I've also created the black keycaps that glue on. I know you can buy these and they'll probably be a lot better quality, but as I'm just prototyping, messing around, it's easy enough just to print some. I actually quite like the texture that they come up with. They kind of got like a, a wood grainy effect, which even pianos nowadays still create that wood grain effect in plastics. So yeah, we can put our harp on and yeah, it's, it's starting to look a little bit better. It's starting to get there. But next, yeah, we need to glue on these keycaps. I haven't done that this part, but I'm just going to lay them over the top just to get an idea of what it looks like. There's still quite a lot to do on this. It's starting to look more like a piano, but it's still got miles to go. We need to make a case, we need to voice it. Yeah, there's, there's a lot of things, a lot. We need to put dampers on it, but hey, it's starting to look like a piano. It's starting to get there. It might, might in fact be possible. But yeah, subscribe and watch out for the next one coming out soon.